Hey, how's it going, everybody? Welcome back to another Empires and Puzzles War. We've got Equalizer, and we've taken a bit of a beating this time, but it's pretty much just a couple teams left, including the leader, so I figured let's jump right in and go for him before someone else grabs him. All right, another team fielding Arco tanks, it looks like. Double limit broken. Quite a beefy guy here. Um... So they've got Aramis and putting him on the flank even, Erlang on the wing. So, what should we do here? Um, well, I think I'll just take my best team here and see how we do with it in Equalizer. Should be able to time it out just fine. Okay. Actually, I find when you face Arco and you don't have minion removal, especially with healing from him and Aramis and ailment blocking, this could be a losing um, endeavor here, so let's do something different. We know we're going to have minions, so let's work with those minions. And... I think still going to use Ludwig. A little bit of a risk. Let's see here. Should have some healing. I think I'm going to choose where is she? This big healer here. Yeah. All right, let's see how we do. Any reason not to take the diamond? I don't think so. Let's go for it. All right, equalizer's right about to go off. Let's not make our classic mistake where we ignore that. Get this good combo here. All right, not enough of a follow up, but we're gonna go for the big old combo because Ludwig is in a great position to survive. So let's, and we'll heal him after. So let's hit and let's go for the giant combo. Oh, so close. He does not survive. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, and the dispel. We're still protected, though. Woo-hoo, damn. And they're fucking fully healed back. Wow. Okay. Hmm, 
this is going to be a bit of a waste, but Man, I'm losing this one. Heal a little bit, and then we'll one tile kill. It will. Okay, that was important. Alright, this one's dragging out a bit longer. Okay, we're gonna get dispelled here. Uh oh. Alright, no minions to heal us. Should we just try to kill? I don't think we're gonna be able to with the attack down. I think we need to hope that. the combo that side. Wow, he's still alive. Damn, I got super lucky here. Okay, now we're all set. So we'll go with this. It should be a lot of damage. Yep. We've got no healing anymore, though. And she evades. Um, he's going off anyway. That's going to hurt, though. <laughs> Just Grimble. Oh, man. God, those Arco teams really present a significant challenge. as many fiend hits as we can before we die. Got them hitting us too, though. Um, shit. End of the line. Wow, big testament to Arco. Not the best team. Like, this is a team where I leaned much more on counters than I did on synergy and power, you know? The damage of this is pretty low, so I was really hoping to rely on Ludwig more than I could. Um, I didn't think he was going to die that quickly, essentially. Um, and that I'd be able to heal him back and fire him again a different time. Come on, combo. No combo. All right, shit. Shout out to our lovely cleanup squad for helping flip this board around. Um, and we can see what we're working with here. A lot green tanks, which is quite unusual. And so many Arco tanks. Um, so, what are we going to do? I perhaps foolishly used two of my um, 
minion counters in the same team, so we'll need to go about this a little differently. In other words, not just attacking Arco only. As much fun as that would be. This seems manageable. This, sti this guy's stats are definitely pretty wild. But a strong red team. The healing's all the way out on the wing, so an aggressive start with a strong red team could do well. She will absolutely destroy Taunt. But there's not a lot of damage here they've got. Yeah, let's try that. We're going to attack my boobies. <laughs> Real mature, buddy. Real mature. So, buff blocking, a lot of damage. What do I want to add to the mix here? Obviously, we need some... Should we go old school? Do I think that's enough damage? Yeah, it's possible I could build up Black Knight to survive the hit from Janna. Man, she was so easy to underestimate because it's like... 470 is not that strong. Like, Phileas Fog, I think, used to do 450. Um, and I still don't understand. She hits, like, her 470 is, like, 1,200 or something. It's ridiculous. I don't understand how that's even possible. And then her second hit, if there's Taunt, has the defense down. And uh, that one's, like, 1,600. It doesn't make any sense. So... We do have heal blocking, and they put their healer out on the wing, so potentially we can get in there. All right, Ariel can charge in eight tiles, so let's see if we can make that happen. So if I take the green diamond, it doesn't do a lot for me. So let's go for the combo here. Hmm. All right, that was the right move to make. Four hundred. That's doing some decent damage there. The big thing with him is just his stats are so freaking high. Um, it's getting a little dangerous to hold here. Two more turns, but I could fire everything now, and then force forces. I think three blues should do it for him for his fast speed charge. Hopefully, that would be pretty shitty otherwise. Or I can try to wait by only matching down the middle. Oh, let's give it a try. Okay. I think this is safe. Ooh, wow, okay. But not the testudo roll. All right, so this is 34 plus an additional three. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that's 58, which is Marginally better, so we'll do it in this order. Uh, Alright, let's see if Jana's going to kill 
black knight or if it will be just the flesh wound. Yeah, 1,693? Are you fucking kidding me? That's unbelievable. It, something doesn't make sense there. I don't know how that is possible. It just doesn't seem possible. And killed by his own color. Alright. I have destroyed my boobies. <laughs> Real mature of me as well. Alright, next up. <clears throat> Alright. Kind of over Arco. Let's give this a try. Mm. Maybe not. All right, we can go for one of these green knights. our very own hippo okay just gotta watch the timing carefully and watch the dispels do have undispellable taunt which is good All right. Can't say no to that. Wow. Don't set him off. Don't set him off. <laughs> oh, and the combo, too. Jeez, that was a... Uh greased up board good night so next up well Malix is going for the toughest teams he can find that is a nasty team um all right, I want to attack this one because the stats on double limit broken costume Alfreich, if her paladin thing, like the one I was fighting had, how is that happening? She had over, she had over 2000 defense. I wonder if it's the emblem path here, if they did something different. It was the craziest thing I've ever seen. Obviously, yes, she has this. Yeah, maybe with troops and the paladin thing, but um, let's take a look here because it was absolutely insane. All right, what are we dealing with? And Encido, nothing too crazy. Let's go with this. And what? We'll throw him in just for equalizer. Then we need another good healer.
All right, I didn't look at what troop she had, but with a troop, 1,600. Yeah, and then if you add a 25% um, boost, she's over 2,000 defense. That's unbelievable. <laughs> so unbelievable. All right, I guess we're firing Tremor first. We've got our yellows too, so Equalizer's gonna set that off right away. Nine forty-four, damn! Because you get the healing bonus. This is after his buff, by the way. Alfred on the wing, though, knowing that. It Equalizer is going to dispel her ailment block. She's charging fucking fast, actually. She's been hit a little bit, but not that much. Oh boy, what are we going to do here? Uh, we got to set off. Ideally, we'd set off Cedo and Anne, and I would just waste my taunt, but I don't. I don't think I can do that. I can set off one of them. But I don't think I can manage both. But the... uh, let's set off Cedo because uh, maybe not Alfred. Because then I can. Oh shit. Okay. Uh, I gotta waste this shit just for one turn. Um, oh, shit. I planned this poorly. Who are we gonna get? Somebody helpful. Uh, not that helpful. Alright, we just gotta heal, try to get that back as quickly as we can, give me blues. Alright, yep, we stole her mana, that's good. This is gonna hurt though. I uh, need reds, but real bad. Thank you. But will it be in time? Just barely. No! Oh, it didn't set her off. But am I dead? But it's equalizer, so we're fucked. It's gonna deal a decent amount of damage from the blues, though. Oh, shit. What's the move here? Blue's got real weak tile damage. I think we'll try to take the yellows into Anne so that the 900... 800... No, it's just missed Cedo. The blue diamond might get her. Might be enough. Oh, definitely enough. You could argue, yeah, you could have looked to see how much damage it would be, but I wouldn't know how much damage she'd be able to do anyway. Like, <laughs> 1600 defense is so crazy. Really wanted to see the paladin thing hit. I don't have any... Oh, man, she's dead. Whew. Yeah. Crazy. Okay. Two more. Yeah, I'm being lazy and not attacking Arco, but... 
I have that option, so why not take it? Um... This is just going for an aggressive team against an aggressive team. Uh, fuck it. So we're not not that far behind in the end, but they did beat us by a pretty big margin. Oh, and it's Reds today. How lovely. <laughs> okay, can I do some clever shit to make a yellow diamond here? Uh, I don't think so. It's not far, but I can't do what I need to do. Looks like, oh my god, we do not need to set him off again. Looks like I can barely maybe get my defense up here before. Oh, shit. Wow, the purples are just non-existent now. How nice. All right, where do I want the attack down? Ah, oh, the shot dispelling is not what we need. So we need to set off these other bozos before that happens. Uh, so let's go right down the middle, which will give us a kill. Cut the attack down significantly. Um, does he reflect stacks? He does reflect the stacks. So... Okay, if we can survive the damage. Oh, and here comes the Dispel. And the Mana Cut. And I finally have what I need. And it's gonna get taken. At least his... Oh, come on, you fucking guy. <laughs> At least he's got the attack down. Nope, doesn't have the attack down. We got a kill, but this is going to be full strength. Smacking. All right, at least... What's his name? Wasn't ready. No! Ah! That was my fault. Oh. Oh. I couldn't have guaranteed anything was there, but I could have seen the the chance was there of that not working out. I don't know if that would have made much of a difference for me or not, but... So we got two fighters here. Will they fight? Kind of. No, they will not fight. They will succumb to sand. Truly weak. Yeah, I think I was just played a little fast and sloppy. Um, last one. Oh, let's see. Who are we going to go for? What have we got? Hmm. 
Hmm. What have we got? So I like throwing Ruby in as a random hero. I think it's about time that Bira gets a costume because that minion blocking is a nice effect to have, but it's sort of gone at this point. Uh, let's go with a all-out blue. And we need a real big healer. Hmm. Hmm. Tempted to throw a gazelle in here. She's not a real big healer, but she does hit hard. Let's do it this way. Okay, where do we want to take this team? We got two reds here, so why not? Last one of the day. Okay, so we got blues into a red, which is often a good thing to do. Don't have enough of any color. The blues at the bottom are not even grouped very well. Let's do it with the combo so we get 10% damage. Oh boy. Um, I think all we need is one tile. Unless the changing tide... Yeah, there we go. It's going to mean taking damage from him, but we can live with that. Ouch. I might go right down the middle, actually. Can we live with that damage? 765. But then I can ghost. Otherwise, what would I do? I'd just try to wait it out, but I don't think that's a good idea. Okay, so now we can transition over to here. Let's... Let's do this first. Hmm. I guess we'll do it this way. Ruby's gonna die exactly. No, 765, she's not gonna die. All right, and now we've got this element link giving 10% mana, so theoretically we should be able to ghost only gets one of them back. Oh, shit. We need to heal. 
Settle down, settle down, settle down. Ooh, fuck. Oh, yeah, that was a little bit of a bad timing thing, but... Oh. Oh, all right, we're going to steal some mana here. Hmm, our yellow's going to... 82... Did he not get mana stolen from him? Oh, they cut her down to only 10%. That's right. Oh, shit. He's at 1 HP, about to deal 700 damage. I could potentially not recover from this. How do I want to play this? A little bit of blue will do it. Uh, let's do this, see if we can get something decent to ghost with. Ah, fuck. He's probably gonna fire in the next turn. Damn it. It's possible I have a 20% chance of a combo of blue on the right side from those yellows, which would for sure finish him off and give me what I need to take out Black Knight, potentially. But it's not going to charge anyone. i got two slash attacks coming. I could also go yellows down the middle, which then gives me a blue after, but I think Sobek's going to fire before that. And it's not going to come close to killing Black Knight. And I don't have anything better. Well, that sucks. And I don't even have a, a way to take a chance. I was thinking I could do the yellows down the middle. Um, or no, excuse me, the greens in the center, the horizontal greens, but that's going to send one tile into Sobek, which that alone probably won't charge, and I could get the blues, so. Oh, God. 81 damage. Oh! Oh! Now it's, oh god. This is not possible. Oh, shit. I need to ghost a full yellow match in order to charge Gazelle. Which would be a huge help, but I don't have that option. I can send three into Green Knight, which is almost going to charge him. And then he's going to kill me. What else can I do? I can try this. Oh, shit. Equalizer, but I have to heal. Absolutely must heal. Uh, okay. Yellow is not getting any damage boost whatsoever. So we can try to get blues into him. No good. Oh, God. <laughs> uh. What a horrible board. Give me something. I can probably set him off one more time. Gazelle's gonna die, but I don't think Perseus will. Oh, I don't have many options here. Oh. 
All right, it's going to set him off, but oh shit! Oh, and he's got the slash attack now. So if I kill him, it's gonna kill me. <laughs> no. And the slash, he will do the slash. Wow, I can't believe I'm battling and losing to a 16% HP, 16 HP target. Is there anything I can do here? I'm going to die in this turn. I don't think the heal block here affects him reviving because it's just a set amount of revive. So either I die to the slash attack or I die to the revive but if I leave it here he'll be at 16 HP but it's not like we need the cleanup anyways and potentially it's a little more embarrassing <laughs> to have a 16 HP black knight or green knight standing hmm. well I lost simple as that Got farther than I thought I would, but maybe I made some careless mistakes to put myself in this position. Perhaps I wasn't in the right headspace after already seeing that we had lost the war. So... Man, if only I had a can't-revive person on my team. Well, it wouldn't matter at this point, because they would be dead. Uh, we'll just have the satisfaction of killing him one more time. prior to our our death <laughs> son of a bitch huh? pretty good after that buff alright well we got outplayed this time that's alright here's the defense I went with we tried running all Erlang and Tremor tanks as much as we had them and then Aramis and other stuff afterwards I think I would have rather potentially run forces as tank um but i did like that he was there to speed up barkley a little bit potentially so it seemed to perform okay i think i got one shot the first time yep Looks like they farmed us a lot. And then one, two. There was another one, two here I saw it at one point. One, two, three. That's pretty good. One, two. It really comes down to where Erlang hits. If he only hits two, then less good. If he hits three, you know, much better. So there's a, a bit of a luck and gamble going on there. Um, but Tremor has the nice ability to stand up to successive hits when the equalizer goes off. Everyone gets almost a thousand. I think, is it boosted health too? No. But still, a thousand HP when you need it, it's a lot. I'm split on limit breaking him it's also nice that you can build him purely as a support hero because his um damage does not scale with attack whatsoever so there's less reason to give him attack it would make his slash attack stronger but i feel like him staying alive for these ailments to uh buffs and ailments to work is better i guess it's just a buff um but yeah i didn't limit break because it's really just equalizer where he shines for raiding and stuff, Hippo, I think, is still the better version of this style mechanic. So anyways, that's it for the war. Um, finally hit 10,000 subscribers. So thank you to everyone who has subscribed. Very awesome and uh, exciting goal to have reached. So please hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.